Hello students, how are you all? I hope you all are fine. Today we will see standard 7 subject science in the chapter number 15. Light. Today we will see part 2. In the previous video part 1 we have seen up to main 3. Today we will see part 2. Main 4. Mark the following statements with right if a true and with a wrong mark if a false in the box given against it each. One mark each. Number 1. A virtual image can never be formed by a concave mirror. It's a true, right? Number 2. A real and a magnified as well as virtual and magnified image of an object can be obtained by a convex lens. It's a true, right? Number 3. The phenomenon of splitting of the white light into seven colors by the prism is called dispersion of light. It's a true, right? Number 4. Each and every type of mirror and lens do form virtual images. It's a right. True. Now see the number 5. The reflector of headlight of a scooter has a convex shape. It's a wrong. False. Number 6. We can obtain an erect and enlarged image by a convex mirror. It's a wrong. False. Number 7. A concave mirror always forms a virtual image it's a true right number eight we can obtain a real enlarged and inverted image by a concave mirror it's a true right now see the number nine a real image cannot be obtained on a screen it's a wrong false number ten a concave mirror always forms a real image it's a wrong false now see the main five Answer the following questions in one sentence, one mark each. Question number one. What is the nature of an image formed by a plane mirror? Answer is, the image formed by a plane mirror is erect, virtual and of the same size as the object. Question number two. What is the nature and position of an image of an object formed by a convex mirror? Answer is, the nature of image formed by a convex mirror is always virtual, erect and smaller than the object. The image is formed behind the mirror. See the question number 3. What type of image is formed by a concave mirror? Answer is a concave mirror can form a real image. Question number 4. What is a convex lens? Answer is the lens which is thick in the middle and thin at its edge is called a convex lens see the question number five what is a concave lens answer is the lens which is thin in the middle and thick at its edge is called a concave lens now see the question number six which lens is called converging lens answer is convex lenses are converging converging lenses now see the next page See the question number 7. State the 7 colors of rainbow in serial order. Answer is red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo and violet. You have to remember the sequence Vibgyor in upward direction. Number 8. State one use of a concave mirror. Answer is doctors use concave mirror for examining eyes, ears, nose and throat. Question number 9. Which type of mirror can form a real image? Answer is a concave mirror can form a real image. See the question number 10. Which type of lens forms a virtual and magnified image? Answer is convex lens forms a virtual and magnified image. Now see main 6. Define. One mark each. Number 1. Reflection of light. Answer is phenomenon of changing the direction of incident light by smooth and shining surface is called reflection of light number two real image answer is an image obtained on a screen is called a real image number three virtual image an image that cannot be obtained on a screen is called a virtual image. Now see the main seven. Answer the following question in short. Two marks each. See the question number one. State the uses of concave mirror. Answer is they are used as reflector in headlights of scooter, car, railway engine, searchlight. 
डेंटिस यूज कॉन्केव मिरर टू सी एन एनलार्ज इमेज ऑफ टीथ वाइल एग्जामिंग टीथ डॉक्टर्स यूज कॉन्केव मिरर फॉर एग्जामिंग आईज यर्स नोज एंड थ्रोट दे आर यूज एज सेविंग एंड मेकअप मिरर्स सी द क्वेश्चन नंबर टू एक्सप्लेन अबाउट द इमेज इज फॉर्म्ड बाय कॉन्वेक्स मिरर आंसर इज द इमेज फॉर्म्ड बाय कॉन्वेक्स मिरर इज ऑलवेज वर्चुअल इरेक्ट एंड स्मॉलर दैन द ऑब्जेक्ट द इमेज इज फॉर्म्ड बिहाइंड द मिरर सी द क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री स्टेट द यूजेज ऑफ अ कॉन्वेक्स लेंस आंसर इज इट इज यूज एज ए मैग्निफाइंग ग्लास इन हैंड लेंसेज माइक्रोस्कोप एक्सेट्रा इट इज यूज इन टेलीस्कोप एंड बायनोक्यूलर्स टू सी डिफरेंट ऑब्जेक्ट्स दे आर यूज इन स्पेक्टिकल्स टू करेक्ट फॉर साइटनेस इट मीन्स इट टू सी नियर बाय ऑब्जेक्ट्स क्लियरली now we will now we will see the question number 4 explain the phenomenon of rainbow in sort answer is generally after rain in the morning and evening the rainbow appears in the sky it appears as a large arc in the sky having many colors it is a natural phenomenon of reflection refraction and dispersion of light due to sunlight falling on a large group of water droplet floating in the sky there are seven colors in a rainbow these are red orange yellow green blue indigo and violet now see the question number 5 state the characteristic of the image formed by a plane mirror answer is image is virtual and erect size of the image is same as that of the object image is formed at the same distance behind the mirror as the object stands in front of it image cannot be obtained on the screen now we will see the main eight in the next video stay safe next video part 3 stay safe stay healthy okay bye